disagree in constructive ways. We have the right to disagree or say no, but we can do so in a constructive way. It is important that we learn to disagree in a respectful way. This can help to keep relationships positive. One way is to use the respect method when disagreeing with someone. R. Respect. Don't ignore or disrespect the person's idea or views. It is important to show respect. E. Errors. Admit your mistake and be honest about things you may have done wrong. S. Similarities. Try to find something that you can both agree on. P. Personal. Don't take things personally. Remember, you are disagreeing with an idea, not the person. E. Ears. Listen to what the other person is saying and try to understand their point of view. C. Calm. Stay calm and don't allow yourself to get angry and shout. T. Talk. Use I statements to explain what you feel, what you think, and what you need. Where to find help? There are times when we find ourselves in difficult situations and we need help. There is no shame in asking for help or advice. Apart from your friends and trustworthy adults, there are several helplines you can call for free advice and counselling. You can find their contact details in the telephone directory, on the internet or at a local library. You can also ask your teacher. Here are some names of organisations that can help. Lifeline South African, Loveline, Childline South Africa, Narcotics Anonymous SA, SA Depression and Anxiety Group, FAMSA. Family and Marriage Association of South Africa. Peer pressure is a bad way of influencing people.